Hello everyone, my name is M. Tommy, Pastor of Peace Ark Ministry. I'm sorry that um, I need to do this um, right now. I'm not really disposed to do a video um, of myself right now, but uh, I believe you're listening to me and you're going to make sense out of it. So there's um, um, a trend right now because Emmanuel TV just announced that um, going off DSTV and Go TV, And uh, some people... Uh, so happy and I started saying all sorts of things and I'm saying that uh, <laughs> the synagogue of all nations, uh, the Manual TV is broke. And uh, there's one prophetess that says that uh, the money of the synagogue of all nations will not last. The money has finished and that's why they're going off. I don't understand. I don't understand. How will you be taking Panadol on someone's, some other person's headache? How will he stay in your house? And somebody made changes and took decision based loan to to him or her or them. And you you now start judging, start suggesting, and start assuming exactly where that person would take that. It's it's a form of foolishness. It's a form of foolishness. Now let's look at it. There are so many big churches right now <laughs> that. They have their. They, they are not on. Uh, they are not on on DSTV. They are not on 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 Go TV. A good manager, a good financial analyst, will sit down and look at things this way. Why am I spending this money? Why am I doing what I'm doing? Why am I getting what I'm getting? Was it really worth worth it? If I should buy this uh, to pay for it, does it really worth it? Listen, uh, someone like me, I can't remember the last time I watched Emmanuel TV on, in my house. I watch it on the go. I spend most time on the internet. The church might have sat down and looked at it. We run a channel on Go TV, run a channel on DSTV. At the end of the day, they, they know they have a track record of how many people that watches them on, Emmanuel, on DSTV. They have a track record of how many people watches them on DSTV and Go TV. And they realize that it doesn't really worth it. Today, every one of us know that today you have you have the greatest numbers of people uh, on on your phones. You know, everybody watches videos on the go. The internet is the best right now, so I don't need to be in my house to watch Emmanuel TV. So I can be on my way to work, and with my phone, I can still reach out to Emmanuel TV. So if the church finds out that they're spending that money for nothing and these companies, DSTV, uh, Go TV, you know, multi choice. You know, most times they will give you so much to just a uh, just price, and I don't know. They'll just wake up and start telling you, and you look at it, and it it doesn't really worth it. Why should I pay more? Please, if it were to be you, will you go ahead or will you take an decision? Looking at is it doesn't really worth it. You will change. That's exactly what the church has done. So going off TV. Going off uh, DSTV and going off um, Go TV doesn't mean that they're broke. It just it means that you it it has got money as you have said, and you don't spend it. You spend it wisely. You don't spend it uh, because the money is there. If you look at it, it doesn't worth it. Why, why would you spend money on something that doesn't worth it? Majority of us all over the world will be on our laptop, you know, on Wi-Fi, watching this stuff on internet, on the internet, on, on, on YouTube mostly, on YouTube mostly. On YouTube mostly. So why would the church go ahead and spend money on something they know is not, it doesn't really worth it? And somebody's there jumping that uh, this judgment, the judge, the money of the church has finished. Who told you? The synagogue of all nations, the manual team is like an ocean. It can never dry. It is endless. You see, the Bible says, whatever God has started, whatever God has created, whatever God has done, can never finish. If it's from God, it can never finish, it can never end. But as a good manager, you manage what the Lord has given to you. That's exactly what Emmanuel TV has done. That's exactly what uh, Synergy of has done. That's exactly what Moby William Joshua has done. And and kudos to that. And we support that. As I'm talking to you right now, I'm on my phone, you know, going through what I need to go through on Emmanuel TV. So <laughs> what's the need? So you go to get a free a free to air decoder. That was that's how it used to be before. Like most of these churches they are on, what they do is they, they have their program under another channel. They don't have like what Manual TV have. They have their program under another channel. Okay? So you, you go to this uh, Christian channel, 
you watch their program you go to that youtube a uh, christian channel you watch their program go to this other channel you watch their program that's what they do it saves money it's uh it's it's wise to do it that way so please i don't understand all this saga so imana tv has dropped uh, an official announcement i'm gonna play for you right now so please take care there's nothing like being broke there's, there's nothing like that forget about all those guys you know as i used to say nobody will say anything good about this church they're only waiting for what they feel is bad news to happen but as far as, far as i'm concerned there's nothing like bad news here it's just a wise decision taken by the church taken by mommy william joshua you know to manage god's money if it doesn't it doesn't want it to spend money on bst and good tv then cut it off we are fine we are fine we are fine on youtube we are fine we, are, we have other other satellites uh, uh, tvs we can watch the mano tv it is the worst status so please go ahead go ahead and watch this advert so that you understand more so forget about and all this information given by these uh haters maybe today they start them we know they are they are way already what god has started what god is involved can never see corruption of course you know that so stay calm and good morning we're in today happy new year to all of you